Hello learners, this is Akshay from Lomo Saki Labs. Today we'll be learning about the advanced move tool in Lumion. So let's check it out. This model was done by an amazing designer whose name along with his page is given in the description below. Now let us zoom into the model and choose the door which we have to use for the advanced move tool. We'll select the door and make it into a group. After that, we'll cut it from here and go save it in a new SketchUp file. Now, let us save this file. Let us now open Lumion. And let us upload this file. We will rename this file, give it as residence and create a new category folder so as to not create any confusion for us. Let us now place the model inside of Lumi. Now let us add materials to our Lumion model. Next, let us go to the location where we want to place our dough and let us import the file. Place the door exactly as its position. Next, we'll apply material to the door.
now let us add two cars into aluminum model Now let us open video and choose record and add our frames as to how we want our animation to look like. Set the scenes and then next we shall move on to the advanced tool function. Next, let us click on FX, go to animation and choose advanced move. After that, we will press the edit button. Now once the edit button opens, we will see another page where we can use our advanced move tool. First, let us slide the time and then set a keyframe and after that, we will start moving our car. The key to remember over here is to give a decent amount of intervals between each keyframe. This will make the car look as if it's moving more naturally and give it a gradual rotation accordingly. Let us play and see how it looks like. Next, we shall add a human being inside our site. We will now repeat the same step for the human being. And again over here, the key is to give a really long distance between each time interval so that it looks more natural when the human is walking.
Lastly now, we will animate the door. Let us select the door. Let us make a keyframe. And now, we shall use the rotate tool slowly at each intervals we will set a keyframe and now we will rotate the door one by one now once this is done let us play the video and see how our animation will look like I hope you guys have understood and enjoyed the video. We will look forward to seeing you. Please do like and subscribe our channel. Now we will see you guys in the next class. Thank you.